Well, welcome family and friends and loved ones. We gather here today to celebrate the wedding of Julian and Anya. And you've come here to share in this formal commitment they make to one another, to offer love and support to this union and to allow Julian and Anya to start their married life together, surrounded by the people dearest and most important to them. We just want to thank you all for flying all the way out here to freaking beautiful Cabo, being here with us. Like, all we wanted was this week to be about friends, family, and just the love we all share for each other. And uh, like, we're just so grateful you're here. So thank you. Anya, as I watched you or your father walk you down the aisle, I could not help but reflect on the yesteryear. You stole our hearts the moment you were born, our priceless gift from God. We were given a privilege to have you, to hold you, to love you and take care of you and to keep you safe as you were growing up. Your journey began way before you sent out invitations, way before you chose this beautiful venue, or even decided to spend the rest of your lives together. Your journey began the moment you first met. That first chance meeting in October of 2015, where you thought you were gonna meet a cute puppy. Instead, you met the love of your life. I didn't believe in love at first sight, but the, that night, when Anya and I were walking back home to the Marshall together, after there was some kissing going on, <laughs> Anya said, this is the first night they met, I'm not kidding you, she said, I think I'm gonna marry this dude. Years went by, we watched you grow up, become independent, and blossom into a beautiful young woman you are today. From the little girl who called SpaghettiOs Spagos, to the middle schooler I would binge eat all the cereal with in the middle of the night, to the high school athlete that I would love and be so proud to watch at games, to the gorgeous human both inside and out she has become. Anya, I truly look up to you for all that you are and all that you're becoming. And I can't wait to watch you grow into this wife role. And now to Julian. We are happy to have you as part of our family. From the time that we first met you, we liked you and your personality, good manners, and the respect for us and for Anya. Julian and we would we are really proud of you of your determination to advance professionally and personally and to have confidence that you will be the kind of man 
and husband that Anya has deserves and has dreamed to have. First off, you know, I'd just like to start off saying that um, I don't know if any of you guys know this, but uh, me and Julian are twins. <laughs> With being a twin, I like to say, which you know, I really think is true. We kind of have a sixth sense, you know. Um, I kind of feel things with him that I don't feel with any of my other siblings. Just to say that is just to really put an emphasis on, I felt Julian and Anya's connection immediately. Samuel Huff. I will never forget the moment that I melted into those beautiful dark brown eyes for the first time. Who knew that a night out with friends six and a half years ago would lead us to this very moment. Surrounded by our incredible friends and family, since that day you have completely changed my life. You inspire me every day. You are my home. Anya. Every day you give me the sight to find my way in this world. When I get lost, I go back to pursuing the man I know I can be for you. I may not get there, but at least with you, I know I'm on my way. For six and a half years, you've shown me a better me. Not a me that always remembers to close cabinet doors <laughs> or Stops wearing your socks. <laughs> but a me that can comprehend joy and know that you're, you're the source of that joy. I vow to always let my love be stronger than my anger. I vow to always keep you laughing, especially on the days you can barely crack a smile. I vow to always encourage you to chase your dreams. I vow to have the patience that love demands. I vow to hold your hand through the challenges we will face. I love you because you fight for me and never stop believing in me. I love you because you're the kind, authentic, and charismatic woman I've always pictured marrying. Marrying you is not only easy, but comforting. Because I get to spend the rest of my days with my favorite person, my best friend. I vow to a life filled with adventure and passion with you. As your bride and best friend, I am so unbelievably excited to say I do. I love you. Today I promise to make sure you never face this world alone. When you're happy, I'll be there. When you're sad, I'll be there. I'll even be there when you need some late night chicken nuggets. <laughs> I love you. I love how we can laugh and be silly together. You're everything that I've ever dreamed of and everything I'll ever need. It's me and you against the world, forever and always.
This ceremony today celebrates the larger vision of we, and we get to celebrate with them. Marriage brings hard days just as they bring beautiful ones. This day is a reminder of what your love has already accomplished and the amazing possibilities of what it continued to accomplish and overcome in the many, many, many years ahead of you. So welcome to one and all, to all who have traveled from near and far. Julian and Anya, thank you for your presence here today and now ask you for your blessing, your encouragement, and your lifelong support for their decision to be married. You've welcomed each other's families and communities and lifelong friends and joined them together with warmth and enthusiasm from those nightly 9 p.m. visits after football practice to today. You have connected heart and soul. By your own words, you have been with each other and for each other. Therefore, by the authority vested in me as a minister of the gospel and in accordance with the laws of God, I now pronounce you husband and wife, and what God has joined together, let no man separate. You may kiss your bride. I'd like to introduce to you today, Mr. and Mrs. Julian and Anya Huff. you have now opened a new chapter of your life. A chapter that's full of dreams, adventure, romance, and excitement. No matter what life brings, you now have a wonderful partner to rely on and to share experiences. You both are the best humans, both individually and unstoppable together. Joy, I love you, bro. The Bible says when a man finds a, a wife, he finds a good thing, and you have absolutely found that. I'm just so, so excited and happy for you guys, and I can't wait to see what the future brings. Anya, the, the brief time that we've known you, you are such a vision of loveliness, so nice, so sweet, and you're just perfect for me. These are two very driven, beautiful young people that I'm proud to not only know, but say, I'm their daddy. 
So raise your glasses to Julian on Anya Huff. This ain't my daughter, law This is my daughter. This is my son. We love y'all. This is our show.